Drastic climate change effects in Africa have been identified as a stumbling block in efforts to tackle the challenge of sessiflies and African trypanosomiasis, also known as sleeping sickness. With the anticipated El Nino season in Kenya, the director of livestock policy research, Christopher Wanga, says the numbers of sessiflies might increase. He is assured that the government has enough stockpile of insecticide needed to fight the insects if they become a challenge during the heavy rains. Wanga was speaking in Mombasa at the ongoing conference of trypanosomiasis research and control in Mombasa. Coordination, there was a DRC as famous, but this time there is an issue in 2024. The response by government, both at the county and national level, you stockpile the vector control products so that you are able to support. The farmers are supposed to buy these chemicals on their own. But any time you detect uh, incidences, proportions beyond the uh, management capacity of the individual farms, then the government can quickly mobilize the stockpiled vector control products to support the eradication. Because any disease that goes beyond homesteads, it is not something that you can now leave to the farmer to struggle on his own. So our utmost uh, resort from this workshop is knowing where each country is, the level each country is, and as such, the level the continent is in relation to CESA and the trips control, and then coming up with a very clear roadmap regarding the activities that we are going to undertake. The European Union has donated information technology equipment